Hello there, this is Carlo. Welcome to another After Effects tutorial. Uh, what we're going to be doing is uh, doing some visual effects with some drone footage. Um, I'll just quickly shot a bit of footage here. Um, it's just over 2k this footage. Um, so what I'm going to do is just going to be adding a crater to this scene. Um, I'm quickly showing you how you would do that. So first of all, I've dropped my uh, video footage from my DJI. As you can see there, straight into a new comp. Um, and I've got my crater uh, picture uh, right there. Uh, so, pretty simple uh, scene. As you can see, just pans up, job done. Right, so what we're going to do next is we're going to track motion at this footage. But first of all, I'm going to come up to animate. <coughs> I want to go track camera. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to wait for that to track and solve. Um, while you're tracking, always keep it in full res. Because you may get some errors or it may not track properly at all if you uh, try to track in half res resolution. So we'll just wait for that to start. What I'll do guys is I'll just speed this process up for you guys. Um, so um, we can get to the actual good stuff. Okay then, so the footage is now tracked and we've got some uh, basic points uh, lying around. Now the trick is obviously to find um, a flat place uh, in this scene, uh, what we like and what we want to use. So I may use, uh, let's just have a look. Right, here we've got a nice scene here, so we've got a nice flat uh, plane right in the middle here. So I'm just going to hold shift down and click that point. that point and I'm going to click that point. Now I'm going to right click and I'm going to create solid and camera. Okay so what that's done is that has put um, a solid um, onto the actual scene. Okay so now very simply what we're going to do is we're going to go back to our project window and there's an alt button on the keyboard obviously so what you're going to do is you're going to hold the alt button uh, with the sorry with the track solid selected shall I say hold your button and then we're going to grab the meteor creator uh, crater shall I say and then hold it just above the solid and then let go okay and now that's been applied to our solid so if we get rid of uh, bits and pieces what I can now do is hit S on the keyboard um, and scale that uh, crater up as you can see uh, but what we've got to do, we've got a bit of work to do on this. So what we're going to do is we're going to get our rotation tool and sort of place it there so we can see it. Uh, we're going to get our pen tool and we're just going to cut round um, our creator or crater, shall I say. Like so. Now I'm going to hit F on the keyboard and then I'm simply going to feather that out it's just enough so it's sort of blending in with the glass itself and then if you click on that it'll turn it off and as you can see um, we've got some pretty awesome uh, crater action going on here so if we play it now we have a really cool uh, crater attached to our scene in After Effects now um, it's entirely up to you obviously how you grade this um, we could do some grading now. So if we, uh, sorry, go back to our composition. Go to, um, let's go to effects. Um, what I like to do is if you go to color correction and go to, um, where is it? Uh, photo filter, click on that. What it does is you can play around with the type um, of look. So we're gonna go for green there because obviously the grass is green. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to play with its density and I'm just going to come back um, just a bit. Now it all depends whether you want this to look long term, like this crate has been here for years, um, so on and so on. Or it's, it's basically entirely up to you, or you want to just leave it. So if we turn the effect off, uh, where are we? Create, on our creator. Uh, turn the effect off and just leave it basically um, a standard colour. 
But then from there, you can create smoke coming out of it. You know, it's entirely up to you um, how you sort of uh, have the look um, of the creator, or the creator, shall I say, uh, in general. So let's just round preview that now. We can sort these harsh lines out uh, in a sec. I'll show you how to do that. That's pretty cool. That's probably pretty cool. So we could get our, um, our meteor footage and then we can sort of play around with the, um, uh, the feathering. Sorry, that's my words there. Um, just to get rid of that sort of harsh line um, to make it look blended sort of more in there it's looking a lot better there like that and that's sort of blended into that as well so i hope you've enjoyed this quick uh tutorial uh please remember to hit that like button if you've enjoyed this and it's helped you out um and guys as always um i will definitely catch you in the next tutorial ciao ciao <laughs>